I love how on the character select screen here, Murray always looks like he just told the worst possible pun and he's waiting for everyone to start laughing and everyone else is trying to ignore it as hard as they can. Hey guys, it's Jag. Welcome back to the arcade. Let's get back to just another game. Slide to Band of Thieves. Last time we finished our setup for the big heist and uh, this time we're going to uh, pull off the big heist. I believe we start as Murray. All right, Murray. Head for the castle's main gate and power down those searchlights. While you do that, Bentley and I will climb our way up to the top of the castle. Good luck. All right, I don't know how I'm going to get Murray up to the top of the main gate, especially since I'm now under fire by tanks once again. Maybe I don't have to worry about it. General guy told the truth, or this is gonna get ugly. Oh yeah, the lights are down, Bentley. Time to call in the cavalry. I'll see if I can find some extra firepower to help out. Attention, bloodthirsty mercenary forces. The castle defenses are down. Seize this opportunity for aggressive military action by pressing an attack on the castle. Charge! For victory, for glory. <laughs> that should do it. Now that you're done being a warmonger, feel like paragliding over to that blimp? Just make sure to grab the rope hanging off that thing. I don't want to drown. <laughs> I love, I love uh, Bentley's obvious take on that. I don't have to grab no rope. Hold on, pal. This could get rough. I don't want to get knocked overboard, but I'm going to grab my rope. I'm gonna knock you guys overboard. All right, let's head for the re-education tower. So far, so smooth. Mercenaries have breached the castle defenses. All of you go defend this tower to the last man. Don't worry, my dear. I still have time to finish with your readjustment. Let me out of here and I'll readjust your face. Keeper, looks like the Shadow Guard is out of the picture. You ready to free our violent little princess? <laughs> Affirmative. That Iron Tech 250 is a fully integrated system. Access to Carbolina's restraints has to be in this old terminal somewhere. Plot convenience demands it. Of course there's a hacking minigame. I'm gonna have to work for it. Alright, let's see. This doesn't seem to be too bad. There is, there is a strong shield around it, but if I go in circles... It won't really do me much good. Okay. Am I mostly going to be dealing with the triangle ships if I take this guy out? I don't see that you've got a spawner. Or maybe you do. I feel like I'm getting more triangle ships than anything else, though. I kind of hope that that's the case. I can deal with the triangle ships. Nope, they do have a spawner. Damn. Uh, I figured they would, but I wanted, to, I wanted to believe, you know? I just wanted that real special moment of happiness in my life. Man, this has got some strong defenses. I feel like I've barely chewed through this. Now we're making some progress. The cost of most of my health bar right there. Wow, cool. Awesome. Good job. Amazing. What else did they throw in the uh, combo game? Yep, I knew that was going to be a bad move. What else did they throw out in Guitar Hero? Let me pull off a sick rift. I forgot. Who knows? Who cares? Let's just do this. Come on. I wonder if I can lure them around and just focus most of my time on this. Got a bunch of damage done. Uh, 
Concentration mode, because I want to get this done. This is actually not an easy gate to bypass. I feel like we've gotten halfway. And just think, we got more hacking minigames to enjoy later in the, in the game. I do like that Sly Thieves in Time really added a bunch of variety to the hacking minigames, so... It wasn't just this, as much as I do like this one, it wasn't just this all the time. That should do it. Hmm? Yay! A girl's I best friend. I isolated the brain pattern. You and I are about to become the best of friends. Okay, new best friend. Hands up! And I mean all of them. My dear, you really should... <gasps> Shadow Guard! Shadow Guard! Come back here, you witch! That Carmelita. Always trying to resolve her problems with the shock pistol. She is rather truculent. <laughs> Stand clear, Sly. This might have a larger blast than anticipated. You okay? This is no place for an asthmatic. But I've located one of the clockwork eyes. Can you find the other? No worries, Taps. It's safely in hand. Mila? Thanks for clearing out the Contessa. Nothing I did could pry her away from the clockwork eyes. Hmm, wouldn't she be enough for the old bird? Ta-ta! Bentley, take the eye and escape on the blimp. I'm going after Neela. Plan. It, this wasn't in the plan. None of our plans really go this smoothly. Honestly, this is probably one of the better complications in our plans. At least we're not getting thrown in prison this time. Attention all bombers. Focus your attack on the Contessa's blimp. What's up, Bentley? You're about to come under fire. Get to the blimp's turret and stay sharp. All right, where'd she go? Yeah, I thought so. I kind of screwed up that paraglider because I forgot that's immediately what you do. And it's another Chasing Neela mission. Focus your attack on the contestant's blimp. What's up, Bentley? You're about to come under fire. Get to the blimp turret go. and stay sharp. I'm going to land before her, but I think she lands here. Close enough. All right. Hopefully that's the hard part done. I've, she is gonna keep setting off those explosives, so don't follow her, her too close, or you'll get blown up. But overall, this mission isn't, or this part of the mission isn't too bad, from what I remember. As long as you know where and when, she's gonna do that and where she goes. Good, she did not land higher up. Ow. And I was way too close. If she landed up higher, I probably would have failed again. Hi friend, let's go. I was waiting for you to do your theatrics. Kinda bored. Where we going? I'm gonna go. You can't get away from me. <laughs> you really should watch where you're going. This place is dangerous. Well, that's one of the eyes. Don't you dare. Is she still this holding one? Is mine. It's mine. No, that's just her lighting. Mr. Cooper, the eye belongs to me. Well, we don't have our boss fight quite yet. Let's check in with Bentley. To come under fire. Get to the blimp's turn and stay sharp. Okay. Oh no, do I, I have to do shoot this these down? I, I forget. Do this. Yeah, I do. Uh, see how many... How many, uh... Planes do I gotta be down? Twelve more. 
And Bandits. just like the last, the uh, mission with uh, the bombers, if they get in close, they will just light you up. I don't hate this turret mission as much as I normally do. This actually feels pretty good. I don't know why, why this one feels so much better than the others if I'm just used to them. If it's the fact that it's bright green planes on a dark background that makes them really easy to see. If it's the fact that you don't have to shoot down missiles. It could be all of the above. Maybe it's also the fact that, you know, I know exactly how many I have left to shoot down. Oh. Go away. Three more. Two more. Oh, there we go. Let's say that's gonna be really unfair if you didn't break apart. All right, last one. It's behind the cathedral. There it comes. Did it. The sky's all clear. Okay, guys, I'm heading out for our rendezvous. Come back here, Contessa. That getaway blimp won't save you. Hey, Slide, can you read me? Carmelita shot out the guidance system, and the blimp's descending at a decidedly unsafe rate. I'm going down! <laughs> down! Down! I was going to say they were using non- It belongs to me, and I want it back. No way. You think I'm crazy? Actually, on second thought, don't answer that. I really don't want your professional opinion. Crazy, just stupid. You're an ignorant child playing dress up in his father's legacy. Oh, I know all about you and the Cooper clan. I think you'll understand why this eye needs to be destroyed. Short sighted fool! I've no interest in your narrow interpretation of morality. I'm above all that. Above good and evil. And you think I'd give the eye to someone that's above morality? Enough talk, insect. It will be just as easy, and more fun, to pry it from your cold, dead hand. I was about to say, fortunately the blimp did not use... Uh, hydrogen, or, but uh, instead used non-flammable helium, but nope, it used hydrogen. So this is actually a fight with two parts. I'm doing a terrible job at fighting her at all. But really, it's not too difficult. If you can avoid... I'm sorry, was that an immoral act? Yeah, I had such low health, I'm not surprised I died. But as long as you can avoid that charge, she's not hard in this phase. The hard part will be the second phase. But we won't get to that for a little bit. I don't think. Yeah, she's very good at running me over, that's for sure. Let's just let her charge at me and then smack her in her big spider butt. I think that's the move here. She actually has still... She still has her pocket to pick. Nah. We won't kill you, Bentley. We'll let some goon do that. But it's good to know that you're alive. Yeah, see, if you just let her charge at you. This is not a hard fight. Be a counterattacker here. I still think it's funny that you can see her pocket from the last mission. Or the last, uh, map. You've shown me the error of my ways. I feel sorry for you. All your education and you still don't know right from wrong. Yeah. Huh? Oof. I know enough not to let my guard down around an intellectually superior opponent. She got the eye? She's got the eye! All right. Thing work. What's this do? And this? Guys, help! Carmelita took the eye, and she's trying.
trying to get away in one of the Contessa's tanks. Don't worry about it, little buddy. I won't let her get away. All right, so now we've lost both eyes, but it's time for the revenge of Murray in a tank. She won't be hard, and we'll get the eye. Keep on shelling her to stop that tank. Ah, uh, if I could remember how to do this. It's already been an episode, and I am worse at driving a tank than Carmelita. Also, this is actually kind of a really convoluted area to drive a tank in. Note to self. Avoid explosive barrels. I think we might be failing this. This takes a couple of tries for me usually. And the thing is, is once Carmelita makes about a lap or two around the area, she gets away. Uh, it's assumed that she learns how to drive the tank and she's gone. So you have to shell her before then. Alright, maybe I, Oh no, I'm stuck on something. I don't even think I've got one shot on her. Yeah, this is this is definitely not a good not a good attempt. I'll get a few shots in at least. Yep. So there you go. Two two rounds around the map and then she takes off over the bridge. Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> kind of in the same boat, Carmelita. Well, how does this thing work? What's this thing do? Fortunately, none of the other tanks bother us. This is like an honorable tank duel or something. Oh, do not drive off. We'll get health from these guys. Cut the corner here. I think I got a shot on her. Not that time, that's for sure. Got her. Grab the eye while Carmelita is still stuck in her tank. Then come around to pick up Bentley for a quick exit. Alright, one eye recovered. No, Slime needs to cover his. We'll all hook up at the rendezvous for extraction. Cover his boo-boo. There's nowhere left to run. We both know I can beat you in a fight. So why don't you just hand over the eye? You're right, Cooper. In a battle of strength, you've proven yourself. But with this clockwork eye. I can battle in your mind. Alright, so now you have to watch out for two attacks. The charge she already did, and then that. She will get a really big head and shoot at you with a green beam. If you are in the beam when she does that, you will lose control of your character and your controls will actually be reversed. So avoid it at all, if at all possible. And that's what it looks like. Chained, got chained. I definitely dodged it. Also, you can't attack when you're in the beam, by the way. That is bull. I am definitely dodging it. At least it will not let you fall off the edge without pulling you back on. You can't get away that easily. And you don't take fall damage. Got 
across at that time. That has a much wider range than I remember it having. Also, she will spawn baddest spiders at you. But, uh, that's just a way to get health. Whee! Thank you. Oh, man. Dodge that by going through her. I'll take it. Damn it, Batty Spider. It's dropped health. I'll take it. You've got a strong mind, Cooper. I never would have guessed. Rude. All right. Took a little bit of a longer turn, but we got both of the eyes and Carmelita's free. We're done here. Things hadn't gone exactly to plan, but the Contessa was beaten and the clockwork eyes were finally mine. The Contessa was arrested and brought to trial for the crimes she committed while working for Interpol. Their PR damage control went one step further by promoting Neela, the hero of Prague, to the rank of captain. Carmelita, still on the outs with Interpol, had to run with the rest of us. To my surprise and eternal delight, I got to help my favorite policewoman escape from the cops. <laughs> I tried to put it all out of my mind. This claw business was spiraling out of control and I knew that my gang was at the center of it. We'd be back in action soon enough, but for now, well, we just laid low for a while. All right, that's the end of episode five. Next time, we're going to start episode six, and I'll see you guys then. Thanks for coming out and watching today. As always, I much appreciate it. All views are always appreciated. If you're new to the channel and you enjoyed what you saw, subscribe because I upload it every weekday. Or at least, you know, just give me that thumbs up and let me know that it was a good episode. If you have any hints, tips, or tricks, make sure you subscribe or uh, leave me a comment. I'll get this straight one of these days. Anyways, thanks for watching again, and you guys have a great day. Later.